Okay, this is the setup in the tractor. This whole piece just drops right down in. It's got a quick disconnect for the power. And then to operate it, you press one button. That moves the throttle one way. And then the second button, I'll take it back. It's just a system, it's got a remote uh, transmitter with some relays in it. And then you got some power strips over here. Two uh, dual pole, dual throw relays. You can use a dual pole single throw relay if you can find it, but one relay will give power to the motor with positive negative one way. This relay will give power to the motor with positive and negative uh, with the reverse polarity to make it run the opposite direction. Then the whole system just has an on off switch up here so when you're not using it you can just turn it off. That's all it is. To remove it, you need to put the throttle in the middle position there, like so, and then you just uh, pick the whole piece right out. So it's just got that bolt, that bolt sits in your three point hitch area, that tab down there rests against that bolt down there so the whole mechanism doesn't move when you're using it. Then to drop it down, you just drop that over the linkage there. You get that bolt down there, like that. You just press the whole thing down, like so. There's the, uh, the tab here, it catches that bolt. So when you're operating this, this thing doesn't lift up from the rear too much. And then of course, before you operate it, you need to put it back there. This rubber hose here, this could have been done with more finesse. That's just so this metal doesn't mar up the uh, shift or this throttle on the tractor. And uh, the reason for the linkages and everything is these linear actuators are cheap. I don't remember the price, but it's a two inch throw. So this lever arm is just to increase the amount of throw. Could have put one single linear actuator up here, but the cost of a linear actuator that has enough throw and that will op also operate quick enough, you're going to be spending $150, $300 on a linear actuator for that. I think this linear actuator was maybe $60, I don't quite remember. It was just bought off eBay. And uh, that's it.